The overall objective of toilet training is to teach your child to toilet himself independently and to no longer wear diapers. The specific skills needed to reach this objective are approaching the potty chair, lowering and raising pants, sitting quietly on the potty until urination, wiping if necessary, emptying the pot into the toilet, and flushing the toilet. The teaching equipment needed for the training is divided into one, teaching supplies, potty chair with removable bowl, loosely fitting training pants, toilet paper, a hollow doll that wets, and two, teaching aids, dry pants inspection chart, prompted potty trial chart, friends who care list. In addition, you will need a supply of snack treats which the child favors. For example, Cheez-Its, pretzels, Pringles, cookies, candy, crackers, and corn nuts, as well as a variety of drinks, such as High C, Coca-Cola, milk, Perrier, juice, and beer. Communicate your pleasure at the trainee's cleanly state frequently and enthusiastically with praise, hugging, and rewards after each action. Remind him that a special treat awaits him upon successful completion of the training. Training Procedure the doll that wets teaches the trainee, by imitation, the specific actions he should learn in toileting. Instruct the trainee to lower Dolly's pants, sit Dolly on the potty, and remain quietly on the chair. When the doll has been sitting on the potty, tell the child to look between the doll's legs, because the doll is about to pee-pee. Encourage the child to praise the doll enthusiastically. Direct the trainee to offer the doll a snack treat. Tell him that he can have it if he will be a big boy and pee-pee in the potty like the dolly. Guide the child as he removes the pot from the potty chair and carries it to the household toilet. Have the child ask the dolly if her pants are dry and have him feel the pants. Since the pants will be dry, the child will praise the doll and offer a drink. After two or three pants checks, distract the trainee while you spill water on the dolly's training pants. On the next inspection, the trainee will discover the wet pants. Instruct the trainee to tell the dolly that he is displeased. Help the trainee carry the dolly rapidly to the potty. Rapidly lower her pants. Set the dolly on the potty for a few seconds. Rapidly raise her pants and carry her back to where the accident occurred. Dry pants inspection. Throughout the training period, inspect the trainee's pants for dryness. Require him to feel the crotch area of the pants and indicate whether they are dry or wet. Show delight at his dry, clean pants by giving him a drink. After each dry pants inspection, check the time and mark the dry pants inspection chart. Remind the trainee of the special treat for successful completion of the training. Young children with limited finger dexterity have trouble with their protruding buttocks, which prevent them from sliding the pants up to the waist when dressing. Minimize this problem by teaching the trainee to bend his knees slightly and raise his pants by placing one hand behind his back, palm facing backward, and holding the waistband while grasping the front of the waistband with the other hand. This hand positioning causes the waistband to be lifted easily over the buttocks. Prompted potty trials. The trainee is required to sit on the potty chair for several minutes so that he will eventually urinate in that position. Use manual guidance to restrain the trainee as necessary. To increase the likelihood of urination after prompting, try to give the prompting at a moment when the trainee has the desire to urinate. Praise the trainee as soon as he begins to urinate with verbal and nonverbal signals. Give the trainee as much of the beverages as he wants in order to create a strong and continuing desire to urinate. Some indications of the desire to urinate are holding genitals, crossing legs, pacing, a sudden change to somber expression, to ensure immediate detection of urination, 
the following techniques are useful. Look continuously between the trainee's legs. Have training pants well below knees. Place absorbent tissue on the bottom of the pot. Arrange the chair in such a way that the light is focused on the opening. Accidents. When an accident occurs, carry out the following procedure. Show disapproval for the wet pants verbally. Have him walk rapidly to the potty chair, lower his pants, sit on the potty for one second, arise, raise pants, and walk quickly to another part of the room where immediately another positive practice trial is started. Have the trainee carry out 10 of these trials. Instruct the trainee to remove his wet pants. Have the trainee carry the wet pants to the usual location for soiled clothes. Have him obtain dry pants and put them on by himself. In this way, the child takes responsibility for pants wetting. After the training is completed, the trainee may enjoy the special treat you have been promising throughout the exercise as a reward for successfully completing the training.